Happy Groundhog's Day. Today is February 2nd, Tuesday. Uh, hopefully this video finds you doing well. Miss you. If you need some extra help, well, this is a great way to do it as well. Uh, to start off, we have a self-start where we just need to write down the formulas for the following types of problems. So to find a percent increase or decrease, this is difference divided by original. Remember, difference means to subtract. So you subtract, then divide by the original. Percent error is similar to that, where you need to do your measured, which is like your guess or your estimate or something. Minus actual, is what actually happened, divided by your actual. For interest, this is uh, how much I party. So I equals P, which is your principal, that's the amount you start with, times R, that's your rate, as, uh, it's a percent, make sure to divide by 100 times your T, which is your time. For markup markdowns, it is, so I'm just gonna use MU, markup over, over cost, sorry, equals percent over 100. For markdowns, over cost equals percent over 100. So there you go. Uh, keep a hold of these formulas because you'll probably want them for your review today. So there's your Chuck Norris facts. Uh, for competition numbers, these are updated as of six o'clock this morning. First hour is still in the lead, but they had three later missing. So their lead on second hour kind of went down a little bit. So not very much separating those two now. Um, Fourth, fifth, sixth, you guys had quite a few late or missing assignments or incomplete assignments. So, come on guys, you can get those caught up. We've still got about four more weeks of our competition. Nope, I, I take that back. We've only got less than three now. Whoa, time is flying by. Uh, today's uh, schedule, self-start, and we are playing Pickle Jar in class. For those of you that are at home, obviously you can't play Pickle Jar, so. That's fine. What I would encourage you to do is just go through each individual slide, solve it, and then show your answer. Solve it, and then show your answer just to make sure that you guys are doing it correctly. So just go through all those, and you should be good. If you have any questions on how to do any of those, you are welcome to contact a teacher, email, or Canvas, and we're more than happy to help you out. Uh, otherwise, that's kind of what we're doing today. We will hopefully see you back soon enough. See you later.